Watch this! Rexa versus Thrall! For Doomhammer, let the hunt begin. Spellstone is good in this matchup. Look for Barnes and uh, Secrets. Flanking is also good. Double flanking is just fine. Okay. Uh, secrets would be welcome here, uh, and as would secret plan or tracking. I think it might be one of the rare, rare scenarios where I actually track in on one just to try and find a secret or the barns. That's a secret. Greetings, traveler. So we can go explosive into coin, flanking, flanking. I think that's enough to get us there. You would need something pretty, pretty big to... Uh, to beat that. Sure. It's so not only juices the spellstone, but it makes our um well both this candle shot and the um like it makes his uh flame tongue totem worse. So I think it's worth it here. You could miss sequence something. Ooh, he almost hit that button. It's a good turn for us, so a slow turn for him is great for us. I can use this to fish for freezing if he just plays a big man here. Okay. I can deal with that. Actually I can just Let's see what we get. I don't think I want a freezing that. I'm gonna kill it. Maybe I should have set up the freezing for the next big minion he plays, but I'm probably just going um, spell stone for three next turn. That's just fine. It's I don't need full value off of this. I just need good value. And then my turn six is like explosive flanking. Alternatively, I could uh, flanking quick shot if he plays a 7-7. Seven, seven. It's like Jade Lightning. Yes, I'm not getting full value off of that, but again, it's more important to like take advantage of the board when I have the opportunity to do so. Devolve is fine. What does this do? I think our Rexar can get better. But there's the 7-7 seven, seven that we were talking about, and this is the... Make a Sea Giant worse. And then set up for Rexar when we're further ahead. I think we're still in a stage where we want to um, we want to build a, an advantage. That's, so that's a five. Uh, this gets me Barnes, so that's game. I'm not killing that. I'm going face. Uh, I've got to clear on that next turn with the Rexar. I'm going to keep the beast over the barns. Do I want the hero power? No, I want a beast. Building beasts is fun.
uh, Knuckles can get there. I mean, even if he goes wide, we just have the uh, the Unleash, plus we have the Explosive. Hey, this is just showing why this is such a good matchup. Our opponent agrees. So, given that the BS report came out, putting Paladin very high, uh, Odd Paladin that is, I'm going to assume this is Odd Paladin, and uh, keep the Rexar. Unleash is also good into Odd Paladin. Interesting. Master's Call on three. Just get the Barnes Yashira and hope he doesn't have like wild pyro equality. The light dims, but fire. It could still be some sort of aggro. We'll see what comes out here. Mind if I roll nope. Me? Okay, so it's some sort of combo. If we can dodge the um the pyro equality, we might be able to get there. Otherwise, we'll just start juicing the secret. Tonight, a tale of or this uh, spellstone, rather. I can also chop through this board with the unleash to. Yeah, there's the equality. I guess he only needed one since he had the board advantage. It's okay. There's a lot of divine shields. Second spell stone seems nice. Discover last lol. Um, I mean this wrecks him if he's Exodia, but I don't think he is, given that he played the the Anoitron is more likely to make it um more likely to make it anything i think and the snipe is just kind of bad into anything i'm gonna make some more minions here next turn is looking like animal companion snake trap uh this gives us information okay the opponent is in fact Anything. This is more mana efficient. This juices the spell stones. See, I've already seen one equality. I wonder. I just need to push damage. The snakes will clear. Ugh. We're just losing onto the board here. I think this has to be, uh... Blanking Bow. I don't think it's a good enough Rexar yet. Fortunately, he hasn't drawn that much other than the Call to Arms. Next turn could be a Rexar Hero Power. I need to make some thick, thick beasts. Oh. That breaks our Rexar. We're probably losing from here, right? Since I got the second bow, it makes sense to give that up. Zero card divine favor. One card divine favor. That is some high value draw. Master's call is not good in this spot. Rexar is just fine.
Web Spinner plus Penguin. <laughs> I guess healing is fine. Almost we were able to get that in play. He doesn't have a great... Oh, that makes his uh, anything a little bit better. There are a lot of good uh, Hunter 3 cost cards. We shouldn't be dead to anything, and he still has 10 cards left in the deck, so... Yeah. Double anything might be a bit dicey, but this was a pretty weak turn. I think giving it lifesteal is fine. Just maintaining my life total here. Second, any fin shouldn't kill us either. six not quite there but this should protect us so i'm gonna clean off this board and set up a lethal for next turn so even with an anything it should be uh, a lethal setup got six from hand This clears the uh Oh, that's uh that's a pretty big mistake. This full clears with the uh the rhino. So I've got twelve if there's no clear. I think it has to be a clear like it has to be a clear. But we beat a clear as well, so I think this is just checkmate. Doesn't matter what we get. That's lethal. No wind, I can see. G G's. All right.